Have you ever wondered who the toughest, most elite soldiers in the world are? The ones who go through grueling training that breaks even the strongest humans mentally and physically. Well, get ready to find out the top 10 most dangerous special forces on the planet. Let's get started. Number 10. JW Grom from Poland Don't let this unit's lack of fame fool you, the Polish JW Grom are some of the stealthiest and most formidable special operations forces in the entire world. Often called in by United States for highly classified missions behind enemy lines, JW Grom specializes in staying undetected while carrying out critical operations. Their training regimen is brutal, designed to weed out even the toughest candidates. Recruits must undergo intensive escape, evasion, survival, counter-terrorism, and hostage rescue courses. But the most insane part is the combat diving certification. Soldiers must be able to hold their breath for up to two excruciatingly long minutes while performing various underwater tasks, even engaging in combat, all while submerged in cold water. On top of that, they are forbidden from all alcohol and fighting outside of official operations, as the Polish government considers them too dangerous to let loose when off duty. Number 9. Russia's infamous Alpha Group With their blunt motto, wherever Alpha appears, compromise stops, you know this elite Spetsnaz force means business. Unlike more surgical special forces, Alpha's tactics involve a straightforward, no-nonsense approach. Shoot every threat throw some grenades, and only then worry about asking questions. This was on full display in the shocking 2002 Moscow theater hostage crisis, where over 100 hostages perished along with the terrorists when Alpha moved in. Becoming an Alpha operator is no easy feat. Candidates endure stringent psychological screening and face extraordinary physical tests, like prolonged cold weather survival training, where they must learn to hunt, build shelters, and even perform emergency field surgery on themselves. When deployed, this terrifyingly efficient unit wields all the most advanced Russian weaponry, including AK rifle variants, PKM machine guns, and potent Dragon of Sniper systems. Number 8. Seret Makel from Israel In a region surrounded by hostile nations and terrorist forces, Israel has turned to the infamous Seret Makel as its most skilled counter-terrorism and hostage rescue unit. Time and again, this elite force has successfully pulled off high-risk operations like the famed 1976 Entec raid and the 2006 operation to destroy a Syrian nuclear reactor. Mackle recruits are some of the most ferociously trained soldiers on Earth. Their exercises include not just intense weapons, navigation, and urban warfare training, but psychological torture as well. In one particularly brutal vetting program, Candidates are kidnapped and subjected to harsh physical and mental abuse by interrogators attempting to make them break. Number 7. The Legendary U.S. Navy SEAL Team 6 When American lives are at stake and the mission is at the highest risk level, the government calls in the renowned Debru operators of Team 6. This is the special force that pulled off both the raid to kill Osama bin Laden in 2011 and the rescue of cargo ship Captain Richard Phillips from Somali pirates in 2009. Just getting accepted into SEAL training is nearly impossible. But for Team 6, that's only the very first hurdle. Candidates endure a training program specifically designed to break them past their limits, mentally and physically. It starts with basic torments, like being thrown into pools, tied up and performing tasks with just their teeth. Then comes the utterly soul-crushing Hell Week, a five-day, four-night marathon, with only four hours permitted for sleep while constantly being pushed to the brink with exercises like running with boats on their heads, crawling through mud, and being pounded by massive ocean waves on the beach. No more than 20% of Team 6 recruits make it through this inhuman gauntlet. Number 6. Denmark's Frogman Corps Denmark's Frogman Corps prides itself on being the modern-day reincarnation of the ferocious Viking spirit, with only about 150 members this tiny unit is highly specialized in operating from the sea to conduct sabotage, reconnaissance, and counter-terror operations. The six-month-long selection process for the Frogman Corps is so hellishly difficult that a mere 10% of candidates make it through the weeding out stages. It begins with intense, long-distance running, marching, and swimming exercises designed to tax the human body to its absolute limits. Recruits must tread water for nearly two minutes while blacking out from lack of air all while putting on their gear fully submerged in the frigid depths. 
Those lucky few who survived this introductory culling face, even more torturous trials. Number 5. Francis G.I.G.N. France's GIGN National Gendarmerie Intervention Group comprises an elite corps of only about 400 of the most fearless and highly trained counter-terrorist operators in Europe. To join the ranks of this razor-sharp special forces unit, recruits are pushed past the brink of normal human limits. The very first vetting exercise requires candidates to swim 50 meters with hands and feet bound together. A devilishly simple test where around half those attempting it must be fished out and rescued from drowning. Those who survived to move on to more draconian trials like running 5 miles with an 80 pounds pack, walking tightrope narrow beams suspended 65 feet in the air, while being berated by interrogators, and even one shockingly called the trust shot, where the recruit must wear body armor and dangle a small target in front of their chest, while another candidate shoots at it with live ammunition. Number 4. Delta Force the U.S. Army's mysterious Delta Force is probably the most elite and selective special operations unit in the entire American military arsenal, comprising roughly 1,000 personnel. Every Delta operator is a hardened combat veteran, having already served in active battles during wartime before even being eligible to apply for this classified unit. Little is known about the brutally harsh training regime that Delta recruits must endure, as much of the information is kept tightly under wraps. What is known, however, is that the program is specifically designed to take the fittest and most experienced soldiers and break them down to be rebuilt into something elevated beyond a normal human condition, an unwavering, remorseless operative willing to push themselves past any limits to survive and complete the objective by any means necessary. Number 3. UK Special Air Service the United Kingdom's venerable Special Air Service, the legendary SAS, represents the gold standard of elite Special Forces units. Their hugely demanding selection process is more like a medieval gauntlet of suffering than a modern military training program. It begins with punishing 26-mile marathons, conducted not once, but six times across five days all while wearing a 55 pounds rucksack and equipment. Those who survive this introductory trial only face further extraordinary hardships ahead like being inserted into remote jungle environments and left alone to survive unaided for extended periods, evading capture by teams of clearing experts attempting to track them down. And once recruits finally return to base after this months-long physical and mental depletion campaign, they aren't given any relief. Instead, they are immediately subjected to horrific interrogation and torture methods like waterboarding, stress positions, sleep deprivation, and more. Incredibly, even after all these torturous trials, only a mere 1% of candidates ultimately earn the honor of joining the elite SAS ranks as operatives. Number 2. Spetsnaz Special Forces Units So who could be even more elite and dangerous than the legendary SAS? Only the unnamed, ultra-secretive Spetsnaz Special Forces Units of Russia. Little is known about these clandestine outfits but their reputation as the most brutally effective special operators in the world precedes them. Even Western special forces prostitute a quiet, wary respect and fear for their Russian Spetsnaz counterparts. Recruitment and training for these top Spetsnaz units is simply horrific beyond words. Candidates are pushed far past the boundaries of pain, starvation, dehydration, and bodily limits that would break any normal human spirit and will to live. Exercising extreme psychological terror tactics, like kidnapping and mock executions, are all used to mold these soldiers into something not quite human anymore. Emotionless, death-defying shadows of utter grit and ruthless lethality. Number 1. Suicide Squad But there is one unit that surpasses even the infamous Spetsnaz in sheer dread capability and reputation. An elite cadre of perhaps only 200 anonymous soldiers gathered from the shattered remnants of Iraq's dissolved post-war military forces. In hushed tones, this faceless organization is varyingly referred to as the Suicide Squad or Bright Lances by those who glimpse them from the shadows. While official organizations deny their very existence, hair-raising rumors and campfire tales have trickled out about this unit's candidates being subjected to indescribably brutal training methods that essentially reconstruct the human soul into an unfeeling, unkillable instrument of utter carnage. Waterboarding, electrocution, starvation, extremes of heat, cold, sleep deprivation, all are mere opening acts before worse tortures are employed designed to detach the mind from any moral or self-preserving restraint. 
So those are the shocking facts behind the world's 10 most dangerous, elite, and terrifyingly effective special forces units. If you found this video intriguing, shocking, do us a favor, like, share and subscribe for more incredible top 10 lists.